Hey, what's up? It's the 10th annual Bucket of Chicken Night. I call it the fifth major. It began as a bet 10 years ago. Stan Barrett didn't think I could do it. I've done it every year since. And tonight's the night. We go for 10 years in a row. Me, Gucci Man, an entire bucket of chicken in my belly. We've arrived at the drive-thru. Let's order some chicken. Yes, I would like three buckets of chicken. One, yes. one for myself and two for my friends. This is one of the most important aspects. A clean handoff is necessary. The clean handoff buckets. This is the best part. And we're off. Piece number one. If Kentucky ever gets an NHL team, they should be the sweaters. Winner, winner, fuck the chicken dinner. I'm gonna let you in on a little secret. I specifically applied for this job for the Bucket of Chicken Challenge. I was 12 years old when Bucket of Chicken Night started. Could I eat an entire bucket of chicken? I'm the John Bouchergrass. Well, they said it couldn't be done. Every year they say it can't be done. An entire bucket of chicken consumed by this skinny dude. Well, we did it again. Buckets. So good. I feel good. So good. Of course, his sodium reading is off the chart now, but that's right. Has Stan Brett ever paid for any of the chicken? No, I feel he, like he should invest here. He moved to L.A. just to avoid that. <laughs> but I do want to be clear that I did purchase the chicken myself to keep uh -huh. my amateur status. I don't want the USCA, the United States Chicken Association, to come down on me hard. I am still an amateur. Yeah, you'd hate to miss out on the Olympics because you are a professional. Good point.